Welcome to the ITU studio in Geneva. Where I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Dr. Supavadi Aramvith, who is Associate Professor in Electrical Engineering for the Chulalongkorn University for the Faculty of Engineering in Thailand. Uh, Dr. Supavadi, thank you very much for being with us today. Okay, I'm glad to be here at ITU and to giving this interview. Fantastic. Now, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about uh, the fact that this year we're celebrating the 25th anniversary of the ITU uh, development sector, something we're very proud of, and, and I've been uh, talking to uh, uh, all of uh, your um, fellow colleagues uh, for this uh, study about. Uh, ICT has changed tremendously, uh, the landscape has changed tremendously in, in these past decades. ITU is now launching a study on ICT for SDGs, and I wanted to ask you, how do you think that this study will contribute in responding to many of today's challenges? As a part of the professor at Chulalongkorn University, we are the academia member okay, of ITU. Yeah, and we are glad that ITU launched this impact study for sustainable development goal because it is very important for the people from the academia member as well. As for the challenges, I believe that there are 17 sustainable development goal has been defined. Yeah, and then for the challenges, I believe as an educator, I would like to uh, emphasize uh, in terms of capacity building yeah, in the, for the qualified professional. I believe this is a very important, especially I mean, in developing country. Yeah. So how to, I mean, how to put the policy framework okay, and also like at the university, how, how you could en use enabling ICT technology Okay, with the teaching, so that it, it has a very good outcome. Yeah, so that is, it, I believe, it is uh, very important. Yeah. So you've been uh, at the university for about sixteen years now. I wanted to ask you, how has the ICT landscape changed for you in that time? Yeah. Uh, one thing, because we have a evolution in the ICT. Yeah. So now we have so many like teacher. Yeah, we have many uh, aids that could help us for teaching like all those uh, ex external knowledge. And then the fast internet that we could uh, engage students, the new kind of the classroom, yeah, that equipped with the Wi-Fi access and then engage the students. So it's, it's not like classroom type anymore. So it can be like the, the group, the, the student can set up as a group in the round table. Yeah, and then they could we could have some kind of the group discussion and, and then they could find out information from the internet as well. I believe with, with those also stimulate a student okay, to, to engage in not, not, not only the knowledge for themselves, but also sharing with others as well. Well, thank you very much for being with us in the studio today and sharing your knowledge with us. And we look forward to the report coming out very soon. Thank you. Yeah, thank you very much.